Hello and welcome to Pico Scope Guided Tests. My name is Mike Wilkinson, I work here at Pico Technology and this is a short video uh, from one of our guided tests to show you how to get a waveform from a common rail diesel inlet metering valve. First thing is how do you get to the test? Well I've got my Pico Scope all running here, all I have to do is I go to the top toolbar on the scope, select automotive, actuators, metering valve and click. Now what's really good about the guided test and Pico scope is that the scope has now set up all the scales required for you to get your waveform. Also you'll see on the screen is an example waveform of what a good metering valve output would be. So how do we do the test? Well first of all we have to connect in the guided test there's a nice drawn diagram and simple instructions on how to carry out the test. So let's make the connections. First of all I'm going to back pin this valve because it's in quite an awkward position on the uh, pressure pump down the side of the engine. So excuse me while I uh, try to back pin and of course I'll need my goggles for this. Okay, that was pretty straightforward. I've used a flexible backpinning probe because there's a little bit of a bend to get into the actual cable. Now I need to connect my scope. So I connected channel A into the probe. Excuse me. And onto a good earth, making sure that I'm not going to rip the leads to pieces with the belts. So that looks good. All I need to do now is start the scope. So I can start the scope. I then need to start and run the engine and come back and stop the scope. So don't go away. Okay, that's running and we've got a really nice pattern on the screen. So I hit the space bar and that stops the scope. <coughs> I can then switch off and now I can use the zoom tools and um, examine the scope in more, the waveform in more detail. Now my pattern looks exactly the same as the example pattern, so I now know that there's nothing wrong with that meter involved. If your pattern looks different then we can help you. Further down in the guided test you'll see um, further guidance. Now, this is written format and it's from our automotive specialists and it tells you about the valve, what it does and what sort of faults you might come across. Also, we've got a waveform library which is a worldwide library for, of waveforms that are uploaded by Pico users from all over the world. So you, you're not left high and dry if your waveform doesn't look like the example. Okay, that's a waveform from a common rail diesel valve. <laughs> Bye.